Thibaut for another animation tutorial video. So today we're gonna see a section transition. So let's see the animation. So moving to the next section and then section is decreasing and sliding to the left. Next one, same. And so on. then finish. Let's start then reverse is also working. again so you see that the corner also are getting rounded and then until the last one then let's see how it's done in bricks so i have three uh, elements one section and for the start and one section for the end and then i have a div with containing the five section. Why I have a div is it will be my track for the pin element. And inside I have my five section. Five, one, a section is containing a heading and a div, which I put position absolute. Um, the section also are um, a position absolute. Okay, the div for the image, so it's getting, uh, I'm transforming it to an image background. And then each section are sitting on top of each other with a position absolute. Then I have done it, the animation in BricksForge, so it's very simple. Um, I'm using um, <coughs> scroll trigger, so the section wrapper. So the div that I use for to 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 wrap the five section, uh, I put a scroll start at zero and a scroll end at two hundred. I'm using scrub, so it's linked to the scroll bar, and I'm using pin. Then I'm animating the section itself, and I'm using the and child um, to target this section because they all have the the same uh, the same uh, class and as i have five section i'm using and child one two three and four not the fifth one because it will be the last one and doesn't have to to slide to to move to be transformed so for each um, that, so there are two, you see, there are two uh, uh, nodes for each section. The first one is to make first Z index, so it's sitting on top of everything. And I'm transforming, so the border radius, I put 100 pixel and a scale of 0 0.95. Then when this one is finished, the second one is starting and what I've done is just a translate of minus 100% so the size of itself sliding to the left and so it's disappearing from the screen. So I'm doing that for every ant child 2, 3, 4. Um, I think that's it for today. So thank you for watching. See you at another video.